Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is get a bell pepper and take out all the seeds and make sure to cut off the stem from it. And that's really creepy what I just did. Sorry about that. So make sure to cut off the white part and the seeds. Okay, so since you take out that, it should look like that. You're going to cut off the bottom because you're going to be making the base of the wreath. So I got the second part out, and then I'm going to cut another piece out, and I kind of messed up on it. But then I just put it on, I broke the sides, and I put it onto the sides of it to make the round shape thicker. And then I try to add another one, but then I messed up again. So then after you get a, I threw away all of them. Just make sure they're all the seeds so it won't get mixed up. And then you get a bell pepper, a red bell pepper, and you cut a little slither out of it to make the, like, you know, like those raspberries, I think, that's in between, like inside of it. Like, you know, the red part. And you put it in the middle of it. So that's what you do, how to make the shape and the wreath. Okay, so since I have a real tree, I put some leaves from it inside of it, but don't use fig trees because that can mess up your guinea pig's digestive system. So use a real, real leaves from a real Christmas tree, or just don't use leaves at all. I use my leaves because I have a real tree, and I put it on top to make it look like the actual like leafy feeling of it. And then here are some clips of my guinea pigs eating it. So when they're munching away, I want to thank you for watching our video. Subscribe to me, thumbs up this video, and comment down below any other treats you want to see or any other ideas I can do for my guinea pigs for Christmas. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye. And Merry Christmas to all of you guys.